So tonight we're going to Kunming Islamic restaurant in Taipei. I'm a little bit hesitant because apparently they don't sell alcohol, but I'm still quite curious to go try the food. This place is rather hidden away, just south of Nanjing Road and between Fuxing and Dunhua Road. You will head down a lane and then go down an alley and then only will you find the restaurant. They seem to be open every day, but some days they're only open for dinner, so make a reservation before you come out here. At the front of the restaurant they have a couple of tables set up and then towards the back of the restaurant they also have a couple of tables set up. The restaurant's not that big. Then they have this really nice private room and this is where we hung out today. One thing I have to mention, it was rather unexpected but there was no background music at this restaurant. The menu is very nice starting with chicken biryani at 200 and then there seemed to be dishes that were discontinued. Vegetable samosas at 180 and I think that was for three samosas. Lentil curry 200, some more chicken dishes and curries, fish, beef, lamb including lamb kebabs at 300. Also a couple of uh, vegetable dishes. This one I think was the vegetable curry. The chicken biryani is really good here. We asked for it not spicy, but I think you can spice it up. Um, I'm sure they, they'll be able to spice it up if you want it spicy. The vegetable samosas came with a nice yogurt and herb sauce. And they are rather large and quite filling, but really tasty. This one is a coconut chicken and potato curry. I'm not sure how Islamic this dish is, but it was nonetheless really tasty and probably my favorite dish of the evening. Some stewed okra with onions, tomatoes, peppers, really good dish too. A chickpea or garbanzo bean curry. This dish contains coriander, so if you don't eat coriander or cilantro, uh, make sure that you mention this before you order. Part of the fun at this restaurant is using your hands. This is my plate. I have some naan bread, then I have a nice dollop of hummus over there. That's my uh, vegetable samosa with a yogurt sauce, some chicken biryani rice, my favorite, the coconut chicken and potato, and then the chickpeas or garbanzo beans, and then some okra. Kunming also sells the traditional yogurt-based lassi drink, which is from the Indian subcontinent. Very good. So do you remember that fish in the beginning? Well, this is what was left of the fish, so I think it's safe to say, even without alcohol or background music, Kunming is definitely a must try.